Well, I mean, we've given evidence before um, about exactly this and presented evidence about um, people who've had jobs in specific areas and then gone on um, to work with companies um, who benefit from government contracts. I mean, there's absolutely loads of it. Um, and I will say the same thing is, what, what do you think these companies are paying the money for? You think they're chucking it away? I mean, and, and when politicians declare their interests, I mean, what, why do they think these businesses are paying them this money? Why did Ian Patterson think he was being given all this money? What, because he's so brilliant? I mean, it, again, I think the public is, is it's very sick of being taken for fools at the moment on all sorts of level, and it's very sick of being taken for fools on this level. If you're taking money from a company, what are they getting out of it? Which is why the earlier answers from both of my colleagues was, at least print the contract, tell us what you're being employed for, and let's have a look at the minutes of the board meeting. What did you say in this specific area? Say you're employed, as Solomon always says, to sell guns or uh, bombs or weapons, um, and then uh, you have a board meeting. If you won't tell us what you said in the meeting, don't take the job. Okay. Not too extreme, Richard? No, maybe not extreme enough. <laughs> well, let me just bring him... Let